Okay, guys, so the first or ornament we're gonna do will be the snowman. The snowman, you, you will need polymer clay. I use this one, I have this big one because I've been using it a lot, so I get the big size. At one, I find some at Walmart, one that I could use. I mean, there's one. See? You will need red polymer clay, white. And also, the other one you will need will be brown. For the nose, you will need orange. So let's get started. So we have to just make it soft. We're gonna do this so all of the clay that we have, just try to make it soft. Oh, the other one, the other color you will need it is black too. Here, black. For the eyes. And buttons. So, the bottom part of the snowman, it will be bigger. Just make a round. Just make a ball. And it has to be bigger from the other ones. The middle one should be bigger than the head. Remember that? So, you have to make three balls. One small, one medium, one big. And then you have to just stack them. Stack. Now the other step will be to with the with the black clay. You would just make little random like circles around. And how I do this for this guys, what I do is to what I do. I just go. I just make like um like a long line I guess make this part small like thin and then with something that you can cut it off just cut them off and then I guess I'll cut two more for the eyes I already cut this one but I don't like this one so it'll be one and two it's okay if the size is not it's kind of messed up um Actually, when you put it on the snowman, it will actually work, even though uh, it doesn't matter the size. And then you just, with them, you just with two fingers, you will do like little balls with them. And then, right there, you will choose what spot you would like to put them, and put them on. See? And then you just push it down, and it makes a really pretty dot. You can put as many buttons as you want that you know it's gonna fit. I'm gonna put three of them. And then there you are. Three little buttons. Now the eyes. Do the same thing and then just put it down there. And then there's your little eye for the snowman. Now this is the nose. The nose is not that hard, guys. Piece of orange. And make, I guess, make it soft. First, the ball. Always the ball whenever you're gonna do something like that. And then with that ball, you will have to, like, with those two fingers, like this, right? You would just go rub it like that, like this, and make a point, see? And there you have the nose, but really easy. And then just put it there. And you can make it smaller if you want to. Well, that's how mine came out. Hopefully, you guys can understand what I'm saying. Like how to make this. The scarf not be that big, that long. Maybe this piece. Like this much of red polymer clay you need. That much. I'm sorry if I can tell you guys how much. Um, how big the polymer clay could be because I really don't know. I when I do my stuff with clay, I just do it like like this. I don't use anything specific. There's no tools I use for my polymer clay and not, nothing. So I guess it's just my hands and figuring out the size by myself. Just do it like how you, just do it like if you want to make a snake. With the bad finger. 
or like in between. You see, it? it's like kind of big as a middle finger. It's the size of the middle finger, kind of. And then with the snowman, just wrap it around, like if it's hugging it, the other one, and you can just go like that. Yeah, you see that it's you can leave it th that long if you want to if not you can actually cut it off with something scissors you can use scissors if you want to if not do something else um, and yeah and then there's your little scarf now we should do the arm piece you would just have to remember make it soft and then Make a snake, okay? Make it like this size, maybe. And then just cut in the middle, and you already have your two hands. And now, just put it in on the snowman. Ready? It's not that hard, actually. With practice, you actually get better. And now, what I do, guys, I used to have stuff for the like this type of stuff like that. I don't know what it could be so I'm not, I'm not gonna show you guys about that but just in case you wanna see you, there's some of this stuff that you can cut like from you can get this actually at the dollar store guys right now especially in Christmas and just cut it off and then you just put connect them like that it's, I don't know how I can show you guys I can't show you because I want to have the things that I need. But yeah, you just connect it to it and then just push it inside. I'll show you a little example. Just push it inside, okay? But this type of wire you can actually get at Walmart and right now in Dollar Tree they're selling them for just one dollar. So you already have your little snowman. The next ornament we're going to do is this one. This little ornament. So I guess let's do it. So you will need green polymer clay and red. Now you can you make it around a ball again. A ball like that. And then pat it down, like make it like this shape, I guess. You just pat it down. <clears throat> this is how I do it. And guys, what I use to make the hole, I use a pen, a pen or something. Cause I don't, know, I don't have tools for this actually. So just make a hole. The good thing that you can fix it. See. So now, just like fix it like with your fingers. The good thing, like if you mess it up, guys, you can actually change it because of the polymer clay. It's easy to fix. So there you go. Now with the red one, you will need to make three circles like this. Three of circles. The one in the middle should be smaller than the um, than the other one. Okay, so if you have to, you have you can make it smaller. I think I'm gonna make it this small, like this small. I don't know if you can see. And just put it there, make it like that type of shape. And then the other one. And then just tap it, like you just go like that, and then you can fix it. That's a good thing. Do another one like a tear type, and then you can fix it. And then the other thing is this part, you would just need two of them, two of the pieces. And I'm sorry, it's the light is going crazy right now. I'm using this flashlight, so you go like that, you can make it as big as you want it. Where you can see the come fix yourself. Okay, like right here, 
right there. You can fix it. There. You can put it there. So. And there you go. And then with, the, with this type of little knife, well, if you're young, don't use this until a parent because you can cut yourself. So yeah, I used to have an exacto knife, but it broke, and now uh, hopefully I could buy another one. And in the middle of this one, you just make like a little line so you can separate them. And then with this same thing, you can just fix it. So you can leave it like that. I don't know. Try to make it as the same size, as the same, I guess, length. And then you have it there. See? And then that's it. Now what I like to do, like this one, I will just make a little line with this knife. You could use a pencil, a pen, or if you're gonna use this, ask a parent to help you with it. You could... There it is. Show you the snowman one. If not, you can just have it there and you can put it somewhere. I think I'm gonna use this this like, for ornaments in my room. Just you can place them anywhere and you just stand. That's what I'm gonna do. Thing I forgot to tell you, it's the line. I'm gonna use this this thing, this little thing, to make the two little lines here. There you go. Those little things. I can look more like a real bow. So yeah. yeah. So that's one of the. That's the second ornament that I showed you guys. The third ornament we're gonna do is gonna be the little shoe. The stocking. And this you would just need red and white polymer, polymer clay. Remember what I told you, when you want to make this thing, just make a circle first, like a ball. I would say circle, and it's not a circle, it's a ball. And then with your hands, you just pat it down. And then like this. Do, this two should go like that to the side, and this one should go like this. And then when it's like that already, guys, with this finger, you just push it to form the boot, and then while you're pushing it, just with the thumb, you will have to, I guess, pat it down more before you push it down. Is it okay? But now it's gonna look more like a boot while stuck in with the white clay. That's why I call it a snake, because that's actually easy. And you can do it the whole, like around it, do the whole around it. With this, you will cut it out. And there it is. Then you can fix it with your hands. You can fix this. And also what I, I do, when I bake them, I will put the names here. So if you want to put it with a sharpie, the names, then you can do that. The other, and I think this is fourth ornament I'm gonna show you, and I don't know if it's the last one I will show you guys, is the candy cane. Now this one, you can use any color you want. You can use green, white, and red. But I'm gonna use these two colors today. The only thing you will have to do, remember the ball on both. And then the snake. And then you will put them together. Put them both together. Pop the extra part. Okay. And then with this, you can twist it. You have to twist it. Do the last part, and that's the snake. Now you can cut extra part and then just move this part here like that, like the shape of the candy cane. And there it is. Now if you wanna do oh if you wanna do these two things, 
You just need three little balls and you will need green because that's small. Okay, so I already made the three little balls. They have to be this small. Well, at least that small. And then the leaf. Just as small as you can. Cool. Like maybe that size. You did it. You have you put them in the top. Like this. Like this form. You have to put them like a triangle type. Like a triangle form. So and then the leaves. And just do the part how I showed you guys about the tear part. And yeah. See? Like the tear. And you will put one in one side. Like that. And you can then you will have to put a line. Line in the middle. Then the marquitas right here. To make it more seem like a leaf you can do this when the, when the leaf is not in the top still on the top and there you go the leaf part is already done and that's the candy cane so there you have it uh, we made the snowman we made the candy cane the stocking and I don't even know how you call this guys I, mean, I just don't know they're the easiest ones that I have done actually um the more I guess so this is the like, easiest or ornaments that I, I want to show you guys this time okay when you're done with them you can go and bake them in the the description or the yeah the it's in in the baggie like you have to put in 275 Fahrenheit yeah, for 15 minutes hard. They get like this one. That's it. Now I'm gonna show you guys what I use for this one. That we use, but I mean, this is for the toast actually. Mine is white, but this is the type that I use. I don't use the big one. So I don't use that one. I use this one. Well, not this one, but one that looks like, like that. And I would just put 250 on it or whatever it says on the on the directions and for 15 minutes. I always leave it for 15 minutes and then it's and that's most Okay guys, so that is it. It was just four ornaments that I showed you guys. I had others but this is the easiest ones that I thought that you guys can do. And I'm sorry if I did not explain it it's like so good but um that's how I, I do it and yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did enjoy it hit like and in the comments below tell me if you would like to you know, would like me to do more um diys of polymer clay using polymer clay i mean so if you do comment down below and also like this video and what else and if you have not yet done it subscribe already go and subscribe down below so you can become part of the wolf pack and of course just un under the um where the when this is subscribe it's a little bell so if you're not no if you don't put that on i mean if you put that on then you will get notified whenever i do put a video so if you guys want to know when i put a video uh click on that little bell i don't know if it's for everybody it shows a bell but for me it shows a bell so you can see when i upload a video so so yeah, so I hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And I guess I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.